Hey everyone, who are here? I just wanted to show you guys this fascinating, uh, what do you call them? Ashtrays? Now we'll take a look. Well, I'm gonna bring it to you. Okay. Do you see that? There's one. There's another one. Can you see this? There's another one. Look, these are positions. I don't know if I went through them all. Look, and she's even smoking a cigarette. It's amazing what you can find in places. Um, so lovely positions there. And it's Halloween, it's October, so I'm watching like all scary movies. I'm watching Scream, Halloween, Jason, Freddy Krueger. I'm not really a fan of any of those, except Scream. I think that one's pretty good. Because it's funny and scary and... Oh, man. And uh, I remember... my. This is like probably the first movie, scary movie or whatever, or my first horror flick I've ever seen that terrified the shit out of me and it haunted me for years. And sometimes I think it still does. But um, I believe it's like the original Exorcist. And... Um, God, it's like the one from the 70s or maybe the 60s. Oh my God, that one was my first one. It was when I was like nine. I was young, okay? And I go and I was living with um, my mom's best friend who is gay and I lived with him for a summer. And that was the summer that changed a lot of things. I saw lots of different kinds of movies, let me tell you. But the exorcism had to be the first one. And I'm telling you, that girl from that movie literally haunts me till this day. She is freaky as hell. And um, I don't know anything real about exorcism and I really don't want to know because it just freaks me out. It really does. I don't like... I mean, of course, my friends make me go watch the movie, so I do. So why not? But man, that stuff is just... That's sick. And I just watched The Conjuring or Conjuring or whatever the hell you call it. Like, all those exorcism movies. Like, I mean, if I was ever an actress, I think I would want to play in a movie just so I could, like, stop my fear of it and know that it's okay and it's, like, not real. But for me, I also believe everything can happen, so it freaks me out. But, like, I used to have, like, I would even make up dreams to make me, like, feel better about it. And I would pretend like I'm going on set for that day for the Exorcism movie, even though it was made, like, 30, 40 years ago. And be like, see, like, it's all just makeup and stuff, but man... I just don't know. It's freaky. It totally freaks me out. So, happy Halloween. And, um, man, those of you who can go to, I, I went to, uh, what is it, Knott's Scary Farm for, you know, Knott's Berry Farm in California. By the way, that was the scariest motherfucking place ever. I did enjoy the shows, though, that you got to sit down at and no one bugged you. It was all on stage, but... When you're walking through those, like, little houses, or even just in, like, a cornfield or the desert, like, fuck that. <laughs> All of you do that, like, I don't understand. Like, I really don't get it. Like, how can you like doing this? It's crazy. I feel like there's someone gonna pop up right behind me right now, because it's all dark and scary and... Urgh, like, murder, killing people, blood, chasing. Not a fan. I'd be, like, the first one to die, I swear to God. Like. People would probably use me as bait and throw me in there to let me die because I'll definitely die. And I think I'll just die of, like, seeing it happen to me and then shock and then heart attack and then boom, I'm dead. So I'll be pretty, like, a waste to kill. <laughs> it wouldn't be fun, okay? So just don't kill anybody or me. <laughs> but, yeah. So happy Halloween and have a good one. <laughs>